you and me, we're locked at home right now. And this is a very difficult time for photographers, videographers, and let's be honest, for anybody under the sun. But if you're currently in the mindset there's nothing that you can shoot right now during lockdown, think again because right behind that door there is endless creativity if you know where to look for it. So don't just take my word for it. Let me show you today what you could be doing from home during the lockdown. Now here's the crazy thing, everything you just saw was actually shot on a cell phone. Today I'm going to be showing you what you can shoot with any phone, but today is actually a video that's been sponsored by Xiaomi with their new beautiful Mi 10 Pro and a 108 megapixel camera plus the ability to shoot 8K plus 960 frames per second slow motion. The list kind of just keeps going on. but. It's not just about the camera, it's also about what you do with your environment, and that's where it's all about creativity. For our first shoot, we are going to be telling the story of an angel that was kicked out of heaven and sent to this living room. To make her feel at home, we went to the local store and bought a bag of cotton. By putting together these cotton balls, we were able to give the look of a cloud on the ground, and then we actually took some other clumps, put them together, taped them to some fishing line, and then taped the fishing line to the back wall to give a bit of background texture that matched the foreground. I'm so glad my parents took a day trip today because I have commandeered the house. We have to act quick before they get home. They're gonna be really mad. This is one of my favorite ones yet. So what you're gonna need is a laptop or a TV, something where you could run a colorful and moving backdrop. Once again, we're gonna use this glass here from the picture frame. On top, we've placed our subject and it's going to create a mirror-like effect if you put something that's black underneath it. So that's the key. You're gonna need either black construction paper or in our case, a box. And then from there, what I did was, I did a series of moving shots as well as gimbal shots where I pushed in, pulled out, I orbited, and some of them were stable. But another cool thing is that I'm able to do this in 120 frames per second. So that slow motion looks super nice, especially when paired with this, a $35 smoke machine. Now I will say there is another cheaper solution because you probably already own an iron. If you have an iron, get it steaming and then you can go all around your object and you'll get a very similar look. This is a stay home videography challenge, but we've come out to the backyard and Kathy here has a beautiful 10 or $15 curtain. And now it's time to get creative with it. So this one right here was Kathy's idea, where she got inspo from like Pinterest or something. Okay. Every single Instagram or TikToker is doing it. Well, it is so beautiful. Wow. Sometimes the simplest things in life can be the best. For this next shot, if you thought it was cool enough to try and do yourself, what you'll need is a picture frame so that you can take the glass. From there, you put the glass on top of two glasses, and then you need a squirt bottle. From there, just apply a few little drops down, and then you're gonna basically take your phone on top, either using the wide or the telephoto, but we got the best results with the telephoto. Now, if I'm being completely honest, these five minute hack websites claimed we should get a result that looks like this. We got this, and I think theirs looks way cooler, but we tried everything to try and recreate that, and I cannot figure it out. I'm not gonna say it's a scam, but sometimes things are a little bit too good to be true in these videos. This has to be my favorite shot yet. <laughs> We've got the glass on top of the box in front of the computer with the rail I've taped my hands to this little board here and of course we got the Mi 10 Pro recording on a tripod But the best part is with a pair of steady hands my brother our pyrotechnic has been shooting WD-40 with a lighter Don't try this at home. We are trained professionals One of my favorite shots has not been with the Mi 10 Pro, but of it. I just put it on some fishing line here, put it in front of a background that was on YouTube, and I let it suspend there, and it looks insane. Like this could be the promo ad, the way the light just 
beautifully touches it in certain places as it starts to rotate. And one of the things that I had to do to stop it from going all over the place was to really try to stop all of its motion. And even that wasn't gonna work, so I usually just left it for 30 seconds to a minute. But I would advise, if you don't see it, put actually a bit of a counterweight at the bottom of it, a little extra fishing line, put maybe something that's heavy enough, and it will help slow it down and keep it more stable. But you need to have a little bit of rotation to get that beautiful shot where the light hits. What I'm loving most about this today is just seeing how much I can do from home. My top two tools when you're shooting B-roll from home, or in my case, me roll <laughs> Uh, it's so far been this $3 fishing line. It's a super easy way to create suspension with clouds or hanging the phone. The next best option is a $30 light from Amazon. So it's incredibly cheap to get professional results. If you see that we have multiple lights here, don't be overwhelmed by that thinking you can't achieve similar results. This was $30. That was $30. Some of these LED lights are actually a bit more. They're about 300 each, but we've hardly used them here in this shoot. It's been predominantly just getting off good white light, which is achievable with those. Or even with natural light, you can use mm -hmm. windows and do it at the right time of the day. Yeah, but again, for $30, you don't have to be at the mercy of what is going on outside, but a good option. For this next trick, you're gonna need some glitter and afterwards you're gonna need a vacuum. But the shot should be worth it. I've seen it on TikTok. It's got me pretty inspired right now. Here we go. Our next shot is this one right here. We're getting nice and cozy, very romantic, with some $15 portable fairy lights. Break. You guys already know, I started the Lost Creator Academy to teach you guys how to become professional photographers, filmmakers, content creators, and I just recently actually held a competition for the best stay-at-home portrait. And in that, there was a couple of winners that won a lifetime access to LCA. But what we're going to do today is actually try to recreate what that winner, Christian, ended up doing for his number one winning spot. So, what we're gonna need is this and some of that. So this shot isn't really going as planned. The bottom of the glass is glazing. The dog won't get out of the way. <laughs> and the glass is too small. But we did our best. This shot right here is one of my favorites. Now what we've done here that's super unique with this phone, the Mi 10 Pro actually has a macro lens. So we're able to get this glass no more than half an inch away. And that's how we get so close up. And that is how you get unbelievable results. One of the craziest features on this phone is 960 frames per second. It looks like this. Now it only runs for half a second because it's such a crazy high frame rate, but if you manage to hit it, I have never seen something slow down that much on a cell phone and still looking pretty good. It is the grand finale. The final shot, Katy's bathtub is awaiting her. This is kind of scary though because if this thing cracks, I mean, I don't want my parents to see this video. <laughs> it's going to flood this floor and go downstairs. And this bathtub is probably a good 200 pounds of water. Just a guess. Wish us luck. We're gonna pour some milk in the water to make it look more interesting. More milky? Uno, dos, tres. Woo! He was like, what's wrong with Instagrammers? <laughs> There we go. Next step, flower petals in the bathtub with the floating head. Sorry, Kia, even I can't explain this to you. Mm. Become a content creator. Mm. Check out the link down below. There's the expectations. And here's the reality. <laughs> Kia, stop making me. And that right there has been my creative home movie as shot on the Mi 10 Pro. 
Now I want to extend the invite onto you to see what you can shoot from home. Within these 4x4 walls, I want to see you get creative. And the awesome thing is you can be entered to win one of these flagship phones if you use the competition down below through Xiaomi. So get over there. The deadline is May 14th, which if I'm not mistaken, is tomorrow. So don't waste another second. Use this time at home to work on your skills and maybe win an awesome prize. So guys, I hope you enjoyed this fresh approach to content in quarantine. A lot of travel stuff to come. But and guys, let's get lost again in the next one. Bye.